bringing up you know with the, regard to the swimming pool, I would like to just you know even though there have been some concerns voiced, I still want to thank you know Mike you know for the work he does up there. I'm sure, the lifeguards maybe weren't perfect, and there's some corrections that made, but still you know they've done a lot of work up there, and I think uh, they deserve our thanks too. Tough year this year. With not enough lifeguards. And the weather. Weather. Yeah, right. And people aren't happy when you can't get the pool open because of the weather. Well, learn how to control the weather. Yeah. I like to do that, but I just haven't managed to get out <laughs> The lifeguard staff was, you know, they did a good job. You know, they get frustrated at times too. So sometimes, you know, their frustration comes out a little bit. Unfortunately, you know, even ours does once in a while and we get you get so much, you get inundated with it, we get frustrated too. They're just kids. You know? They were young. <laughs> yeah, so, so do one eighteen. One that was eighteen and they're all younger. All young. Yeah. So Well if there's anything that, you know, can be done to help them well, repair think, or for the public. I think yeah. us just knowing about it. Yeah. If I don't know about it, they don't know about it. Right. Unfortunately, that's the way you would, the people dealing with, I'm going to call the, the council people instead of telling someone that will actually do something about it. Like I said, the one person that did call, we talked to them about it. They understood. Mm -hmm. But well, thank we'll, you. we'll work on it again. You know, we'll keep picking away at it. That's just the way it is. Well, thank you very much, and thank all of you for coming. And if there is nothing else, I would take a motion for adjournment. So, Thanks, everybody. It's, it's